from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Juliet. And I'm Lindsay. This is your WCCO at the State Fair newscast. We begin today with a developing story from the Midway. Right now, State Fair officials are on the lookout for a giant stuffed gorilla. We're told it's black and lime green and is as le at least eight feet tall. It was spotted last near the Ferris wheel. Officials don't think he is dangerous, but if you see him, call 911. Over near the pet center, fairgoers are reporting a strange howling sound. Officials were called in to investigate. It turns out it was just the dogs at the pet center trying to keep up with all the people belting out Usher and Sam Hunt songs at the giant sing-along. That's a look at your State Fair headlines. Let's send it over to sports. Hello, I'm Brad with a look at sports. A bit of controversy is brewing after a new grand champion has been named in the State Fairground Drink Toss Rodeo. A 10 year old for a girl from the Iron Range went 5 to 5 for being new for Chris Rowe by 1 to 1. The West Canadian team is on the way to us against the story. It looks like the 10 year old wasn't ringer to Rafa Iowa. We continue the Thank you. It is a hot one out here in Minnesota State Fair. So hot that ice cream cones are melting in less than two minutes. Snow cones are lasting only about three minutes and warning that brain freeze numbers have tripled this year as fair goes try to keep cool. I'm in the I'm in the weather center. Back to you. That's your news for today. I'm Juliet. I'm Lindsay. I'm Brad Worcester. Thanks for watching. Don't this has been a WCCO4 news update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.